What is up guys, it is Joey here today. I got another nice one in Newport News for you. This one is 1311 25th Street. 1311 25th Street. And before I say anything about the house, I'm gonna ask you guys to like this video and subscribe to it so I know you guys are watching the video. And I'm gonna tell you as well, if you guys are on my channel, the house I just posted three days ago on 23rd Street sold within four hours. Yes, it sold within four hours. And this one is pretty much just an identical layout of that one. It's the same size, same condition. And this one, honestly, might be a little bit nicer. So let's go inside and let's go take a look. So first off, we're on 25th Street, a nice house next door. They're doing some road work on this road right now, getting some new houses up and running. We have a mechanic shop right across the street. And this is at the corner of 25th and Oak Ave. This is a one-way road, so just keep that in mind. This is a one-way road. Cars can only come this way. There's no two-way traffic on the street, one way. So overall, this house is in phenomenal condition. It can use some cleaning, use some cosmetics, some carpet, some paint, but overall, it was lived in as of yesterday. Everything is operational lights power however however you do know we sell all of our houses as is so that means we don't guarantee anything see there's some siding up there that's falling off definitely use a pressure washing it is operational however we do sell it as is we don't get any inspections done why i say it's operational i mean i mean it appears operational the water is running the lights are on actually let me double check i don't think the lights are actually i think they cut them off already this morning Anyways, nice uh, nice porch. Be careful, there is a wasp nest in that corner. Front door appears to be somewhat new. All right, so living room. You have a very, very big living room in here. Very big living room. If you know the houses we deal with, this living room is gigantic. Carpet is definitely gonna need to be replaced. So another thing I've noticed, uh, a lot of houses I have that smell like dog, they're flea infested. This house smells like dog, but there's no fleas, no bugs, nothing like that. So that's always a plus, but if they definitely had a dog living in here and you can tell because there's that big ass crate in the kitchen. But the carpet's definitely gonna need, be need to be replaced. You can see that's where they had their TV mounted. Like I said, overall this house is in phenomenal condition. Everything looks great. This is your washer and dryer room. The appliances do not come with the property. It's a mess in here, seems a good cleaning. Coming on back here is our kitchen. We have a water cooler here. This is our kitchen. The kitchen is in great shape. Everything appears to be good to go. We have our stove over here, the range, a lot of cabinet space, and we have a nice black fridge. There's not appear to be a dishwasher. No, there's no dishwasher on this property. So if you were to add one, that'll be at your own expense. I'm gonna walk around, actually I can show you right here. I try to avoid touching anything on these houses, but I'll open the door, I'll be nice to you guys. So you do have a deck back here. You do have a very big deck. And there's a washer back here. So maybe the washers did work whenever they left it. And there's a grill, very large backyard. You're fenced in on the left and on the right, or on the left and the back, the right is not fenced in. All right, so that's enough of that. And as you see, this kitchen's gonna need some cleaning up. There's my favorite, every single house I deal with, there's dog shit in here. So that already knows the clientele that used to live in this house. And this is their bathroom. The clientele they used to live in this house. A uh, nasty shower with the roach on the floor. Bathroom downstairs, everything looks great. It's a small patch, small patch in the ceiling right there. Looks like something leaked upstairs. And the toilet. All right, so that is everything downstairs. Now upstairs we have another full bathroom as well as we have three bedrooms. So going up the stairs, the stairs are immediately, when you walk up to the front door, they're immediately to the left. We have our breaker box right here. 
All right, so let's go up and take a peek. The carpet does seem to be replaced. They don't think there's any salvaging this. It's very filthy, very old. Baseboards definitely need to be cleaned. Replace the handrail or paint it. There's a small hole right there in the little thing on top of the stairwell. They left a lot of stuff behind, as expected. A lot of people always do that before they leave their house. All right, so coming in through here, this is gonna be the bedroom, or sorry, bathroom number two. Bathroom number two. I didn't physically come in here yet for my photo, so I'm sure there's nothing in here. Bathroom number two. Everything looks like this one looks a lot cleaner than the last one, so a lot cleaner. This one has a bathtub. Downstairs had the stand up shower. There is no door to the bathroom. There is no door. The door frame is all kinds of fucked up. It's like someone just kicked it open. All right, so coming across the hall is bedroom number one. Which is the smallest of the three bedrooms. Bedroom number one, it can definitely use new carpet and paint. As you see, there's, I don't know if that's piss on the wall or if that's poop on the wall, but uh, it's what I deal with every single day for work. So I'm used to, that doesn't even affect me anymore. This door is broken as well, because I saw one kicked it as well. There's not even a doorknob. It's holes in it. The door frame's fucked up. I'm not even gonna touch it. I don't even know if it works, but let's continue on. We have the small hallway continuing on through here. Could definitely use some new paint and some new carpet if you decide. Right here is an upstairs AC unit. Definitely, this is probably where the leak was that was causing downstairs. I can feel right here on the floor is a little bit of dampness. So this is probably what was leaking and causing the bathroom downstairs to have that hole in the ceiling. Right here is bedroom number two. That's a lot of stuff behind. I am not going inside that attic. I don't even know why it's down. You can see there's also a small hole in the roof. I can see straight through the roof right there. So just keep that in mind. I'm not going inside that closet. Definitely use some new paint. This bedroom is the biggest of the three bedrooms. And then right across the hall right here is bedroom number three. This is the second biggest one. Painted purple, overall good condition. Nice dresser I left behind here. All right, guys, and that is it. This is 1311 25th Street, Newport News, Virginia. Three bedrooms, two bathrooms. And if you're still this far into my video, like I said before, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. When I get nice houses like these, they sell within one or two days. Last time I had the house on 23rd Street on, what was it, Saturday or Sunday, whatever day it was. I never even got around to listing it on Facebook or Craigslist or all my other marketing places. I uploaded the video and just from that it was sold. So if this is something you're interested, you know my number guys, 757-384-0905. Once again, 757-384-0905. And I will talk to you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.